Exactly. I was like, good, let's get it over with. Okay, so we've we've tapped into, you've woken up, uh, you're in uh, uh, sort of surgery at this point uh, that was um, uh, agreed to as long as they don't hurt uh, or, or scare you. Um, and we're right. down to 10 minutes left in the show, Ricky. That was that was a quick 50 minutes for me. I really enjoyed what we did here because uh, I think this this sort of uh, structure is working out. I'll get your feelings or what have you after the show, but, um, you know, so yeah, we're down is. to 10 minutes. I'll keep this up. Um, okay. Uh, but uh, I, 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 I'm sorry. Go ahead, Ricky. Did you want to go to another hour or whatever? I do or have the next time walked out, and I was going to ask you if you'd like to. Now, one thing I do want to note is that I am – set up to go to the end of the abduction, uh, and uh, I have a few, uh, uh, I, I work my way into um, uh, the after uh, notes, but I didn't cover every single detail because I didn't know that we would fill it all, um, but I do want to make sure that this story is out there, that we give any callers or chatters or, uh, uh, something, to, something to chat in, and then I'd also like to maybe even go a little free form if, they're, you know, if we're not getting a chatter or a caller. I'll, I'll just randomly ask you what's up or see what I can pull out of some notes. But I'd like to give that part of the story because it's a whole other ball of wax when you start talking about um, your after notes on 2015, life after death, et cetera. Right, 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 right. Um, but maybe we yeah. can do a to be continued, and I can set that up just like I set this up, and, and we'll go at it. Yeah. Um, if you're interested, Ricky, if this is working for you, um, what do you say, man? I, you want another hour, or you want me to uh, – I'll do it there if you got time. Ask, do you have time for another hour? Yep. Okay, cool. Good stuff, Ricky. So we'll we'll just keep moving. Uh, nine minutes left in the show. When we're down when when we're down to well, actually, uh, what we'll do is go ahead and plug plug a little bit. We'll stop right there. I think we found a good stopping point, and we'll go into the next hour, moving on from the skin surgery, which gets really interesting as far as uh, what uh, uh, else they uh, did to you during the surgery, as well as uh, what other events transpired. Um, so, but anyways, Ricky, I do want to make sure that our audience can get a hold of you uh, because you're an interesting guy. Maybe there's somebody else out there that picks up the archive or is, that is listening in uh, that would like to help your story further along or, or talk to you, uh, give you somebody to talk to, uh, kind of like we're doing here with this forum. Um, you know, how, how do we find you, Ricky? Uh, you got Facebook, you got MySpace, you got YouTube. Uh, how do we find you? Um, you could actually email me if you'd like at. Uh Again, it's UFO abductee at hotmail dot com. My YouTube at uh, UFO abductee. That's my channel. MySpace the same UFO abductee. And my um, you can find my Yahoo uh, chat thing on there. But MySpace, I mean Facebook is the best. It's Ricky UFO abductee. It's definitely not hard to find. Ain't too many of me out there. Yeah, man. I, I would also like to ask, um, you know, uh, we'll just go off topic and, and quit with the story and just uh, uh, finish this show up here. i got oh, seven minutes left. Um, but I'd also like to ask, how does the public receive your story in general when, when you're talking to people and you're explaining to them what we're explaining to people tonight uh, throughout your Facebook community? Um, I'm sure it's very two-sided. You've got people who receive you good and bad because that's what humans run the gamut of. But anyways, can, can you share with us a little experience what it's like being a, a contactee and, and uh, uh, you want to know the truth. this crazy world? Man. You want to know the yeah, truth? the truth, man. I'm going to tell you the truth and don't get offended. You guys don't I care. It. You guys don't care. Nobody cares. Nobody cares because this is the this is the most important message in a thousand years, and nobody cares. You know, we got what we call a transition coming up here, though, Ricky. And um, you know, we have uh, the term "waking up" per se, or something like that. Would you say, though, right. that maybe there is uh, uh, kind of a, a sense of caring at this point? I understand 2012, and the world understands right. 2012. We also understand right. what may come after 2012 and, and things like that. Right. Uh, not to make that a main event here, uh, because I understand that you have a 2015 date that we'll get to. Right. Um, but, um, but, you know, we have a transition we're coming up on, and it is rapidly approaching. You say nobody cares, but maybe we're doing the show, and, and uh, all of a sudden we've got, you know, a new five people that care that uh, now want to interact and be within the community, add to your listener base or, or right. a follower base. And, but but, you know, I, but so the I problem is... Nobody doesn't care, but I, you're another book in my, in my library, right. I would like to say. This is another story well, in, in but, a big book that I'm writing for myself, so... But see, that's from... The outside looking in. I'm from the inside looking out. There's only one of me. 
right. and I'm the only one that has talked to thousands of people. I'm the only one that's done a hundred interviews, and I'm the only one that is experiencing this. And I'm not saying that I'm glad and all that stuff, but I know. Okay. And 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 maybe that'll make you realize what I'm saying that uh, when I mean nobody cares and humans. Humans are really comfortable, and we're really spoiled, and we're, we really don't care a lot. And that's why it's going to take what it's going to take to make us care. When all we got to do is care now. 2015 can be avoided if we do what we have to do. That's the message that I get out of a lot of, uh, per se, contactee uh, looking into that I do. I've not been uh, in touch with too many contactees at this point. I've got a few under my belt, but uh, uh, you mm -hmm. being one of them, of course, Ricky. Um, but, uh, mm -hmm. you know, uh, there's other ways to research contactees and, and the subject of uh, 2012 evolution, anything. Uh, YouTube's a fantastic resource. So, anyway, right. in, in, in reviewing all that, I think that's the number one, pretty much the main message that I pull from abduction stories is that I got a message. I'm not dead. I, I'm, I was brought back here, and now I've got a message, and the message is, seems to be, Wake up, people! You're destroying the world. What's you know your ornery your 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 race's orneriness at this point is destroying uh, a beautiful ecosystem. Uh, you know, I, I believe could be a rarity in 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 the right. universe. I'm okay. sure there's many different types you of gotta, worlds, many different types of creations, but you know you it, never know. You, you got a couple minutes, or are we just about to get cut off? I was gonna try to explain something real uh, quick. Got, we're down to uh, three minutes here, Ricky. Uh, go ahead and wrap okay. it up with what you got. I'll do my little outro. Okay. We got the next hour. Okay. We're going to have to dial back in, people. But go ahead, Ricky. Okay. I look at it like this. We we don't look at life like we look at us as life. Now, who who is to say that each planet is not alive? Each planet is not a, a some kind of being or some kind of life. Now, look at it this way as us being the little fleas on the planet. And we're not just scratching the surface anymore. We're just digging thousands of miles into the skin or to the surface of this being, this loving being. We're doing more than giving it mosquito bites. We're giving it more than just losing a little hair. We are fleas destroying the, inc the whole being. And what happens when something happens to humans that like if something's eating our skin, we, we get an immune system and we will destroy it with just our immune system. So it's almost time for this planet to just make us go away. You know, yeah, we just own immune systems. Just shaking the fleas clean or, you know, if I get fleas in yeah, the house, I get right. a couple of bombs but, and I set them off and I eliminate them. So Right. Can you imagine if fleas kill dogs? You know what I mean? I mean, we're, we're literally specks in this whole universe and we're destroying a whole planet that we were given. That's there's right. There's no other choice for that. There's no other choice. The common threat is, is almost consciousness. It's like a cry uh, uh, that, that uh, we, or a kick in the butt that we really, really need. Um, as a race, and being somebody who's never been abducted, uh, well, actually, um, I leave that open-ended. I don't remember any abductions at this point um, that I could solidly tell, such as Ricky does, uh, but being in that position, um, you know, the redundance is clear to me, and, uh, you know, just dealing in, in the material world, not outside of this atmosphere, um, uh, the, these frustrations, I believe, lie in the hearts and minds of everybody. It's kind of like that dirty elephant or secret that's in the back of the mind or in the room. Uh, that, that needs taken care of. Now, guys, we're down to the last minute here. Uh, thank you very much for joining us Wednesday for the first hour here at Coil Hat Radio uh, with Ricky, uh, UFO abductee on uh, YouTube, Facebook, and MySpace. He'll be joining me next hour as well. Ricky, you're going to need to call back in. Use the same call-in number. Uh, fans out there, anybody listening live, you're gonna, uh, you can hang out in the chat room. We'll come right back on on your player, I believe. You may have to refresh. Uh, but we have to do this for now until we can fund a full, uh, full go um, uh, premium account. Anywho, thank you very much for Foil Hat, with the, or Foil Hat Radio. This is PJ Creamer. Um, I was your host tonight uh, on this Wednesday edition, May 26, 2010. Thanks a lot, Ricky. We're going to go off the air in 15 seconds. Everybody have a ball.